I just came back from a trip to Lake Crescent, Washington. Um, for those of you who don't know, the lake is it's super deep, uh, amazing water clarity. At some points, you can see down 60 feet. Um, very unique. In fact, so unique that a special um, special type of fish called the Beardsley Rainbow Trout um, inhabits that lake and only Lake Crescent. So I decided I was going to go out and, and try fishing for the fish. So I I'd, I'd kind of looked on YouTube, looked around. I didn't exactly see that many videos on on how to do it or or just honestly people's attempts. So I figured, huh, why not? Why not try to um, make a video myself so anyone else can see what I did and see my luck. So I ended up going out the regulations for the lake. You have to use a single barbless hook on an artificial lure um, and there's a little bit about a weight requirement. I think it has to be under two ounces. So I yeah so I <laughs> took off my treble, treble hooks and tried my luck. I ended up um, doing some dock fishing uh, as well as fishing from a small inflatable raft. Long story short, um, we'll get over to the actual footage, but it was pretty good. I ended up catching fish on uh, the best lures, the Castmaster, um, kind of one of the smaller sizes and this rainbow color, and then I put on a single barbless hook. Uh, hopefully you guys can see that. And then the other lure I had some success on uh, was the Panther Martin? Um, not like not like the normal ones you usually see. I don't exactly know where I got this. It's got a little feather tail on it, and then it has a single barbless on it. So those are the two I had the most success on. I tried doing some jigging uh, and trying to get it down deeper because this lake gets extremely deep, um, and I think that's where some of the bigger fish are. But yeah, just ended up um, spinning on the top of the water, not not trolling, but just casting and spinning and. Yeah, had some decent luck. I uh, caught one from the dock, and I caught a few in various points uh, around the lake. And then one evening I went out. I'm I'm really new to fly fishing, uh, just trying to just trying my luck. Um, ended up tying a fly about a week prior, a wooly bugger. I don't really know if the color scheme was that on point, but I threw it out and actually ended up getting hooked up because the lake drops off super steep. So I wasn't I didn't have to cast very far. I just threw it out there, got a bite, and <laughs> that was it. It was pretty pretty great. I don't have it today because I actually ended up snagging off the woolly bugger, but yeah, I, I was happy. It was it was a good trip, so let's get to the footage. There we are. Oh, he came off. Oh my goodness. Oh, we're on. We're on. Oh, that's a big one. Keep up. Keep the tip up. Okay. We're on. We're on. Oh, what the hands? Okay. Oh. <sighs> Came off. Dang. I'm gonna go get the net now. They're loving this castmaster, though. Wow.
Oh, we hooked up. There we go. There we go. Oh, oh, came off. Oh my goodness. Oh, so close. I just threw it up when I was working the drop off. There's a glacier lake, real steep. How unfortunate. These barbless hooks are, make it hard. Oh, get the net ready. Beautiful fish. Oh, calm down, oh, buddy. Dude. He's croaking. He's a croaker. He's beautiful. Oh, we got one. We are on. No, it's yep. Again. Yep. Oh, can I get the net? Can I get the net? I want Where's you to get it in the net. Where's the net? Okay, I got it. See the net? Oh, it's a big one. Come on, stay up. Stay up, buddy. Mm. He's fighting. Hook him, hook him. Yes! I'm gonna let him back in one second. Okay. There you go. Look at that. Beautiful. Oh! Beautiful! That was awesome. Wow. It was the first time I caught one on the gold spinner this trip. Felt, felt bad about clipping the barb. Um, but hey, it worked. Wow, that was a rush.